it's a um, 83 bed, 100 million plus project on 22 acres in Harker Heights, right off uh, uh, 190 on the south side. It's going to be a full service acute care hospital, medical surgical service, a full seven by 24 emergency department, OB, nursery, all the medical surgical services, including cardiology, orthopedics, urology, oncology. Uh, and uh, we built this hospital primarily because the, the good demographics in this market and the growth that uh, the market's growing at approximately 2% annually, which is good growth any place. And so we felt like it was a good opportunity uh, to uh, build a new hospital in the Harker Heights clean market. Well, Seton had explored the possibility of being in this general market a couple years ago when we evaluated the acquisition of King's Daughters Hospital in Temple. Ultimately, Scott and White acquired that hospital, and so you know we started continuing, or we continued to look at this market, and ultimately LHP had an interest in the market, and we talked together to see if we might want to do something together. And here we are. While healthcare is a big business nationally, mm -hmm. we we really do believe that the best decisions in healthcare are made locally, and so. Uh, getting the medical staff and the local community leaders involved in that decision making is kind of the way we're organizing this uh, so that they have their input on both the governance and the management day to day decision making. And clearly, it's an exciting time to culminate what I'd say is the first phase of the work the planning leading up to, to creating the joint venture, the negotiation of the joint venture itself, the signing of the documents. But really, what happens now is the real work you know, planning and constructing the facility, planning for the opening, uh, working on staffing for the new hospital, working with the physicians to make sure you know, that the equipment that we plan for meets their needs, and also recruiting some additional physicians to the project.